You've probably noticed that I am pushing my application to GitHub and then checking page speed insight on, on Vercel. And you might wonder first, can I use page speed insight on the local host? And if so, how to do it? Okay, so, so we can search for page speed insight on local host and you see here an answer. And you can do it using a tool that is called Lighthouse on a Chrome Dev Tool. Okay, so let's open Chrome. Let's run my application. So now I'm I'm running my development version. This is npm run dev. We'll run the development version. So it is running on localhost. Okay, so let's put it here. Let's close this and this and this and this. But this is uh, my Firefox, so I need to open it on, as I said, Chrome. Okay. And now you can open Chrome DevTool and there is a tab that is called Lighthouse. And if you scroll a little, you will see that you can analyze the the performance actually if you will remove this 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 and this this will be exactly what we the 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 grade that we get from page speed insight so we can We can invoke it like this. But notice that we are running now on the development uh, version. So first you see that we got very bad um, performance and this is because the development uh, version is not optimized. It is not a good idea to invoke and to check performance on the development version so we can bypass this by simply stopping this and creating npm run build okay what what will happen now okay um let's let's go in, inside the file system let's remove this and what you will see now that when I'm doing npm run build, the dot ne next directory is created. Okay, he's building now the build version. Also, when I'm pushing my version to Vercel, you see now, dot next. And this is now the build version. And this is also what is, is done uh, on Vercel. So first I need to create the build version. And you see, creating an optimized pro production build because in development, it does not have to be uh, optimized. So when you are checking performance, you should not check it on development. You should check it on your build version. So question uh, is, can we now run this uh, production uh, version? So, it, and the answer is yes. And you can go here and you can uh, do npm run start and this will run npm run start. This will run the uh, production version locally. Okay, 
So, we are running it locally, and let's go, let's refresh here, okay? So what we have now here, this is local, um, my local machine, and on my local machine we have our build version, our version that will be used also on Vercel. And now let's try again to see if we can use the lighthouse, okay? So let's invoke again, put it analyzed. We got before 27, which was very bad result. And let's see what we get now. I'm suspecting to get better result. I'm getting error. Not clear why I'm getting errors. Let's try again. Let's try again, okay? Analyze page load. Okay, now we're getting, before we got 27%, and now we got 47%, but, and this is the build version, so the reason, we need to ask ourselves why, and let's uh, go inside, and, and what you see is that this, uh, reduced unused JavaScript. This is actually third-party resource, which is our looks like Chrome extension and and other stuff. So let's try to do another uh, try and let's run try to run it on uh, the following on uh, iCognito and let's see if we are getting even better result now. And let's now invoke it again for the third time. So we are running now locally with the build version using iCognito. So let's see if we get now reasonable result. Okay, so we are, we are improving, but again, this is not an optimal Again, third party, block the main thread. And so you, you see that it is not working very well on uh, the, local, the local machine. And if I will go to Vercel here. Okay, let's go here. Vercel. Okay, let's invoke it. Let's take this and let's, and if, and if we were, were going to use now the production, um, link. Okay, now I'm losing, using the production link. I'm using the lighthouse um, on my Chrome dev tool. And let's see how this will function. Reduced unused JavaScript. So again, th there is, um, oh, let's, let's run it on iCognito. Okay, well, let's now try. So I'm using the production build on production, but using the lighthouse, which is on my home dev tool. And let's see what we get. 
Okay, so now we get uh, the better result. But anyway, um, if we are already have to deploy to production, I might as well check it here with uh, page speed insight. Okay. And provide it with this. Okay, so the bottom line is <laughs> if you want to check performance, uh, simply deploy it to uh, production and, and then use paid speed insight as I did before because using development is uh, not optimized. Using production on localhost, uh, there are JavaScript third party that are uh, disturbing. So again, bottom line, deploy to production and use page speed insight.